Open the door. This is Ambassador Martha Boyd. You are in violation of international law. Well, it ain't gonna work until we are a family. Good afternoon, Lieutenant Colonel Johns. Last time I checked, Langley, we're not at war with Yemen. Well, we respect state sovereignty and the rule of law, Colonel. We're regrettably facing a sub-state adversary who abides by no rules. Out of necessity, this war on terror has become borderless. Uh, well, let me inform you that I'm having news lot up before the European Court of Human Rights. Ever uh, hear about the Nuremberg trial stress? That's where we got the Nuremberg principles, which then the UN made it to international law just in case ordinary jobs become criminal again. Good evening, gentlemen. Uh, tonight we're offering the enemy combatant whereby a person is not a prisoner of war or a criminal, which means, of course, that he has absolutely no protection under the law. We're also offering an extraordinary rendition where suspects are abducted without record on foreign soil and taken to foreign prisons in countries that still torture. Oh, that sounds delicious. Should the Palestinian Authority resubmit its application to the UN for full state recognition, it is the intent of this administration not to exercise its veto. It's greed and mistrust at the root. Okay, next. The five permanent members of the UN Security Council are the United States, Russia, I know. Let's just forget the whole thing.